Oh well, guys, good morning, good morning. It's me again, Ryan, and I'm back with a pretty good day trading recap. I was right all the time. It's just this is the the part that I think I kind of missed because I got stopped twice, shorted it here, took most of the profit here, most of the move here, which is really, really good, and took it long here, took some profit, stopped out, took it long here, took some profit, stopped out, but look at that. It's really, really nice move. I was right twice here. But after that, I was like, I got stopped twice. I should stop trading. I just can't can't do it. Uh, I need to practice stop trading. So what happened was, uh, so I got rejected here at my yellow line levels. I actually was considering taking, looking at this 17 area, but it looks like it's not going to uh, hold. So it went up all the way to... Uh, 22 i have a level in there so when when it when it dropped i kind of like this drop i said okay there's a seller there um so i took it short in here risking probably 14 dollars so yeah not bad so shorted it here 703 took took here uh took some off here vwap here and at the line where i took it long look at that now it bounced so those are just key levels 50 50 area 50 cent area round number area right i know just trade those levels and look at vwap levels just just trade those levels um what else uh oh yeah let's watch my trade so i forgot i i'm still on trade uh still hold i will hold this until it goes break even or maybe 1609 if you know if i'm lucky there's probably a chance it might go down here but we'll we'll, we'll see um mm -hmm. there you go let's watch my trade mm -hmm. all right get opens so I was closely watching 70 and 90 area. If it goes 90, I'm going to take it long. If it goes 70, I'm going to take it short. So I took it short for move to VWAP. Actually, VWAP and 1609, the level I have in there. Come on. There you go. It was really easy to move to short because, I mean, stock wasn't SSR, but it was easy for me to short. Maybe because it's up it's up too much so there you go view up was just my target it reached my target reach more of my target so 1609 is like a level uh it's like a level in the pre-market mm -hmm. took some more off in there i was actually thinking if i should get all out at 16 35 or 40 area because i'm sure it's just gonna go up to my break even again uh let's see yeah i took half of what i have left and if it touches 16 40 again i'm just gonna get out the so 16 67 is my average cost there you go So I'm all out, yeah. Man, look at that. I think, yeah, probably gonna go 17 for sure. I was actually considering maybe I'll take it long and break out, but it's too far from VWAP. I don't want to do that. If you want, yeah, probably here is you want to just trading at VWAP and round numbers is the best thing you can do. There you go. 1686 is the high of day. Let's see. Yeah. That see that? Orders. Very easy. Easy breakout. So had it fast forward. So <clears throat> I actually wanted to take it short, like here at 22 area, but I don't know where it's gonna go. Yeah, this is this is where I want to take it short, right? It's too far from VWAP. I have levels here. If if it makes new one minute low, maybe this that's where you short it, risking. Oh, that's yeah, that's a heavy drop. Maybe wait for a pullback, short summer at 1715. 
I don't know where it's going to go now because I can't really remember. And now you're too late. So this is where you would want to short it. Risking here, right? Just trade at levels. And it's a round number. It's probably going to go down like maybe 50 cents. Yeah, 50 cent move. Imagine that. So <clears throat> let's fast forward this where I, sh oh my God. I seriously want to take it short here. 16, yeah, this is where I took it long. Took some off. My God, I left some good profit in there. Shit. Took it long again. Oh, oh my God, another good profit. That could have been a, this too if I took profit here. It would have been a nice, nice profit because I was just risking 45, like really, really tight risk. If I took profit here, uh, come on, don't stop me out. 58. Yeah. There you go. Now it's back to 60. Just it just stopped me out and it went all the way up to 14 22 area oh my god it just went all the way up without me ah i feel the pain but you know i'm trading not trading training myself how to handle this kind of uh Maybe stress. I don't know. Uh, this 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 kind of feeling is. I kind of don't like the feeling, uh, but, but yeah. But I I took it short here. So since I missed that move, come on. There's always gonna be another move. So don't chase. No flipping. No chase. Stop twice. Stop trading. Those are my rules. Partial partial patient patiently. That's why I didn't really take. A lot of profit here because my rules are partial patiently. Partial patiently. If you got stopped twice, let's just stop trading. No chasing, no flipping. Step a loss. Those are my rules. So it's back to VWAP. It looks like it's gonna. Oh, maybe it's gonna hold 1683. Yeah, let's see if it holds 1683 and then uh, we're probably gonna maybe add. I don't know. Yeah, maybe it could be a good add in here. Yeah, we'll see. All right, uh, if you like this video, hit subscribe. If you have any questions, just comment down below and if I'm free, I'll get back to you. Uh, yeah, maybe on the weekend because I'm still busy at work. And yeah, that's a pretty good week. I think I, yeah, I did not have a red day. So it's a pretty good week. Oh man, look at that. I just said it, I took it short here. Add. Probably gonna go back to 50. And if it goes back to 50, if it doesn't hold, oh my God, 1620. Right? Uh, let's, let's move our stop here, 1685. Let's just. Maybe we can take you one if it goes sixty four I'm gonna take some off, yep, it's not sixty four sixty one okay, yep, yeah. I'll take some more off and let it go to sixteen eighty five or sixteen eighty six It's a pretty good one. So, yeah, have a good day, everyone. Stay safe and have a good weekend. Cheers.